Now, Deputy Speaker of the House of Representatives, Right Honorable Benjamin Okeze Kalu, expressed concern about the increasing number of uneducated girl child and sexual gender based violence in Nigeria. He promised more legal instruments to address gender inequality in education, including establishing more schools in rural areas. Your child has been discouraged, afraid, threatened, frightened to pursue education. Even when the resources are there, even when they are called to there, they are afraid when they think about what happened in Borno State, but it ought not to be so. There is hope for the current administration to right the wrongs of the past administration with regards to the girl or child. And I'm sure very soon the percentage is going to reduce from what it is now to a manageable percentage. We are not promising it's going to be wiped off completely, but there will be a step to show that considerably the right policies are in place even as we promise as a parliament we're going to use the instrument of our legislative interventions to ensure that that space is cleared to enable people like you grow with the knowledge that is gotten from education the group led by Khadija Suleiman visited the Deputy Speaker to congratulate him on his election and uh, also to request his support for the advocacy on girl child education. Our reasons why we are here to present to you this honor today include but not limited to your hard work and dedicated service to God and humanity, your dedicated service to our nation, charity to the less privileged, your efforts so far in the legislature, following your track record, the role you play in carrying all relevant persons along in your policy making, irrespective of gender, cultural background, or faith. Among many others, too numerous to be mentioned in print. It is respect to the above and even much more that the leadership of the female student vanguard for cultural education in Nigeria are gathered here to present to you the female student instrument of commendation as an icon of exemplary leadership because of the duties which you have done and those you are doing. History should start doing you justice. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.